Well, it's finally cold enough in Canada, at least in southern Ontario, to do my first cold start of 2009. It's the middle of the afternoon, and it's cold enough that the snow still hasn't melted. Probably about minus three Celsius. So, this New Yorker has been nesting back here for a couple months. That cozy little warm spot between the cars. I haven't tried to start it since. Uh, I usually leave the battery disconnected. Ugh. Ugh. Yep. Alrighty. Got an interstate, so let's see if she held her charge. I won't even try priming it. It's got a 400 engine in it, cubic inch. Let's go find the key. Gee, I got lots of keys. Come on. My most tarnished key, I think. There, there she be. You can tell that sucker's old. Is that the 76 New Yorker? All right. Nothing living in here. I'm fine. Contact. Pumpage. Slammage. Okay. More pumpage. Yes, it. Sweet. She's running. dependable. I think Leahy could approve of getting this car going every morning and depending on it to get to the liquor store. No wonder he has a car like that, or did. No smoke, tiny bit of steam. Still don't want to waste this car. It's too rare. I wish someone would buy it. You know, just give me 700 bucks before the snow flies and it's yours. The car works great. One owner. It came from uh, New Jersey too. Got all the paperwork with it. Shut her down. Oh, I hate those old 70s buzzers. Good enough for me. Oh, so, I hope you all got your first fix for your first cold start this year. Lots more to come. Oh, what the hell. We had so much luck with that Chrysler, we'll start this one, the Aries Turbo Wagon. It's been a while. Push the clutch. She's a 5 speed turbo intercooled modified Shelby Z 2.2 with 230 horsepower. Awesome. All her near belt's a bit loose. Lots of keys, but it's got the third motor. Perfect. We'll shut her down. 
What a sleeper. <laughs> the look on some of those faces on people with Mustang GTs that I passed and <laughs> beat them in races at the track and stuff is just awesome. You'll never forget it.